David Vaudrell on, but here we go. Three. Finish is there. And he's three to one. It's a local. Devin Vega from San Antonio has smacked in goal number three against the run and play. Talk about making the most of the opportunity here. Great energy. Vega with the ball, a little bit of skill, lays this one into Reed. Great first time ball from Reed. There's the through ball. It comes to the By Pekka, and now it's Vega coming the other way on the counter. Vega loses his man inside the area. Now an option to his right. Goes for goal himself, and a casual finish into the far side of the net. Devin Vega coast to coast. It's 3-1. to one. Again, S2 just caught. They had all the possession all the opportunities and just like that it's all started from Pekka it's good calm defensive work from him takes it right off of Zach Mathers Possession heavy by trade, as you would expect. Forbes, good challenge there, takes it away from Moberg. Billy out top, Vega gives it a go! Oh, one oh. nothing, San Antonio FC! And what a sweet tasting golazo for Vega. One of the things that we highlighted the blueprint of putting pressure on Moberg. Moberg trying to play out of the back, gets stripped, dispossessed right here. Presence of mind to angle this ball. Great first touch right here, disguising that far. San Antonio FC, but here's Josh Phillips coming across, winning that challenge, and Sion McFarland winning the second one. Good, good play from the switchbacks, and great feet from Masta Kasher. Back line with a big collision. The fans behind Vega. Tripped up in the box, a penalty coming up. His man inside the area now, an option to his right, goes for goal himself. And I he couldn't hold it though, and Forbes is right on him and wins the ball. Billy Forbes. And for Devin Bay. Give and go between the two of them now here. Wide for Tierpack on the right side, edge of the area, plays it back in towards Vega. DeVitt trying to deal with it. Now here's Vega, fakes with his left foot, hits with his right, and misses the target. Up out of the air. Quickly looking to go now, Travis Caesar. Pick the pocket from behind. Nicely done by Devin Vega. Devin Vega. CFC so continue to, to be a little bit more relentless as they navigate their way through the end of this first half and see if they can go for the second. And Vega looks for that second goal with Billy Forbes in tier progress as a striker up field. Kept alive by Nuna. Vega. Around DeVries. Vega. Forbes. But that in and of itself is going to be sufficient. Updated possession for 20 minutes. It's really been all San Antonio FC. And another nice piece of footwork from Devin Vega on display. Here is the 
reigning Defender of the Year. Tried to slide it through, but cut out nicely by Devin Vega. This is how Phoenix loved to play. Vega through for Freighter. He's on side. Come on, Freighter. Oh, what a goal from Phoenix. Credit on that initial save, particularly. Just got enough on it with the fingertips to push it off the bar. Or the post, I should say. To get their bodies acclimated, but still nonetheless professionals, and they have a job to get done. As we are officially underway from Casablanca. a little bit. You'd like to see them close out the game in that manner. The header down, but easy work. Away by Lindsay. Referee takes a look at a stopwatch. Says play on on that challenge. So some time here for Phoenix. Still loose in midfield. And Asante. Devin Vega. Manager from Uruguay in his second season with Los Alvos. Devin Vega after the turnover. Going to feed Billy Forbes. He's been very active early on. Asante. Able to turn. Has 
the Bows running. Sit a little bit more, stay a little bit tighter, not push so high on the pitch, and enable Forbes and Asante to get more involved. Because when we've seen the ball at their feet and down into space, they've been very integral. Drogba on the turn. Just trying to bully it. Which then causes a collapse in the middle of the field, which is what we're seeing. That's a real issue for the Rising right now. They're playing against one of the most yes. two center backs isolated against almost four in the middle of the field. So if you want to play that way, that's fine. That just you have to push the ball high on the pitch, because if you don't, you turn it over, and you're constantly against odds going the other way. After that opener, able to make a chance to tell. Season. Phoenix still with a couple of games left in the Mobile Mini Sun Cup. And Saturday at 3 p.m. against Sporting Kansas City. The Angelin of excitement. Oh, that's a good. Their passion for the team is incredible. They bring it every game. There he goes again. Oh, he, he's, he's making busy. things he's happening for Rising. For joining us tonight here to watch this game, exciting game between the two Phoenix teams, Phoenix Rising and Sporting FC AZ. And that's what we want. We want a competitive match tonight. Here's Vega sending it in. Melvin knocks it down, but Tierpak with his left foot blocked away by. Probably want to get there without anything else happening. 100%. percent you got to keep the, the back four, back five solid and not concede. Now here's Forbes cutting in with his right foot. Kevin Vega. Oh, great ball. Turned wide by Billy. They have tied this thing up after an Ebra Clementical. It was a Jaqua. And that's where we stand here at Sacramento. possession to Vega in midfield. He'll play that up the right side of the park, forcing DeVries to hustle back. Distance. 
blocked on the way in. And now, can we finally see the transition game of San Antonio? Into space for Forbes. And we reserve for Billy Forbes that we've seen many times this year. Yeah, but what a, what a great asset to be able to plug him in there and let Billy then run along up top. on the left hand side again a little bit more likely was in the, the early stage of the first half. Moberg heads this one forward. Michael Reed. Yeah, Michael Reed playing phenomenal. That little exit pass out of the back into intervene and he can pull up in the midfield. Tear back. Vega. Richard Dixon or Stepping in, Vega, springing four. Really opened up here as Marco Bustos finally makes a touch on the ball here, but concedes possession immediately. Vega over the top, Gordon making the run. Over heads this one forward, Michael Reed. Yeah, Michael Reed playing phenomenal. That little exit pass out of the back into their team. Yeah, yeah, four time good. MLS All Star with Sporting mm -hmm. Kansas City. This ball for Vega. To the outside. Wallace. Daly. Snaps the header. Clear pack. Drives it out. Dixon from distance. Locked on the way in. And now, can we finally see the transition? Oh, Restrepo was there. Restrepo serves a nice ball forward to Vega. But Jaqua. Talk about the tension for Highland to get forward. Luke field position tonight. Well, primarily an outside back. Vega for a Jaqua. Sweet spot for Lee Johnson to come out and grab. Here's Cochran now moving forward to the left side of the touch here. Sacramento has dominated possession here in the last 10 minutes or so, but the line Forbes. Forbes to the right side. Trying to get it through. Christian comes up. Here's the youngster, Vega. Vega down low near Newton. Riker goals too, where you see like, you know, the great Raul from Spain or the Chicharitos, another one. He's always, he always finds ways to get that ball on target. A little quick touch here, looking for four. Pulls a play tonight, and that is a good sign, hopefully for his return tonight. But eventually at one point would be a great boost to San Antonio FC's great attack. Ball. As a Jake looks for this ball in the box.